It's been a stressful time recently for cloud providers. Only a week after AWS took down a lot of the internet, Microsoft Azure also went down Wednesday, affecting thousands of services including Xbox, Kroger, Alaska Airlines, and Starbucks. Even voting at the Scottish Parliament was suspended because MSPs couldn't access the system. Tens of thousands of users reported issues on Down Detector, with outages spanning Microsoft 365, Xbox Live, and Minecraft. So what happened was an inadvertent config change to Azure's infrastructure triggered a DNS issue with Microsoft Front Door. DNS is essentially the internet's phone book that translates website names into numeric addresses where the servers live. So when Azure's DNS system couldn't properly route the traffic through front door, all the servers were still there, but Azure just couldn't figure out where to send the people trying to reach them. What is interesting is that this is the second major cloud outage in two weeks. Last week, AWS broke the internet when their US East 1 region went down with a DNS issue very similar that affected DynamoDB. An expert from Royal Holloway noted that Google, Amazon, and Microsoft have a triopoly on cloud services, meaning that an outage from any one of them can cripple hundreds of applications. What do you think these companies can do to mitigate these outages in the future? Follow more tech and AI news.